hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be creating this look using the Too faced cosmetics pumpkin spice palette this palette blends like a dream beautiful color scheme and smells so good hi guys welcome back to my page so today i'm going to be doing a another look with the pumpkin spice Too faced palette this is going to be more of a purple look because i'm in a purpley mood so these are the colors here this is what the palette looks like she is gorgeous let's do a a nice little close-up so shiny and smells amazing um so yeah we're gonna do a little bit of pumpkin spice because you know every woman on the planet loves pumpkin spice you can't deny that you don't like pumpkin sure let's get started also guys before you leave don't forget to like this video, share it, give it a thumbs up, and follow my page if you want to see more videos like this one. Also, you can always, you know, request notifications for when I post a new video on my page. And that would really help a girl out a lot. Alrighty, let's get into the video. So I'm going to start going in with the shade Sweetie Pie, focusing mainly on my outer corners, but also putting that all over the lid and into my crease. This is going to be my transition shade. Now I'm going to be going in with the shade Love You A Latte. And I'm just putting that again, focusing mainly on my outer corner and blending that into my crease. As you can see, I'm patting it on the outer corner and then slowly blending in. Now I'm going in with the shade You Spicy. This is one of the pink purpley shades and I'm focusing that on the outer corner, kind of creating a V and also bringing that onto my crease. And as you can see, I'm putting it on the outer corner and then just blending it into the crease and trying to create a more seamless look. Next shade I'm going in with is Spice of Life, and this shade I'm really focusing on the outer corner, kind of creating a little like V triangle and then putting that on the outer crease of my eye and blending it in to create more depth to the look. Now this look is all about blending because there is several colors, so blending, blending, blending is the key here. Now I'm just taking that shade Spice of Life and I'm putting it on my waterline and just smoking it out a little bit. I'm also, when I put it on my waterline, I'm connecting it to the ends of my eyeshadow to create an extreme seamless look. Now I'm taking my Mary Luminizer highlighter and just putting that in the inner corner of my eye to give it some extra depth and highlight. Now I'm going in with the shade Want a Piece of Me on my inner corner and half of my lid. Now I'm just taking a blending brush and blending everything together with that uh, shimmery shade. Now I'm taking the shade Oh My Gourd and I'm putting that in the inner corner of my lid to give it some extra dimension, dim dimension and brighten it up. Then I put on the Pumpkin Spice Liquid Lip from Too Faced Cosmetics as well. Now I'm going in with the Urban Decay. Um, this is part of the Stoned Vibes or Stoned Gems collection. This is a 24-7 eyeliner 
and the shade Raw Energy, and I'm just going to line my lid with that. I'm also going to put this on the waterline to kind of help bring everything together. Now I'm going in with the Epic Ink Liner from NYX Cosmetics and I'm just lining my line, lining my <laughs> lid <laughs> um, just with a simple straight line and then I'm going to add a tiny little wing. And now I'm going to go in with my lashes. These are going to be the Batty Bee Lashes in the style hashtag baby doll. These are one of my favorite lashes out there. Literally, my favorite lashes like on the planet. And I'm just going to line the lash with the duo glue. Make sure you put on a very generous amount. And I literally like just set it down, line the other lash. Once that's done, I also set that one down. And then I go to apply my lashes. These lashes are the easiest to apply, super quick, super simple, and it's so easy. So literally, look, I put it on, take my tweezers, adjust the front and the back of the lash onto my, <laughs> onto my lid, and that's it. I'm just adjusting the inner corner of the lash and the outer corner. As the glue dries, it becomes more tacky and it kind of sets in place and I'm just readjusting it just to make sure. Now I'm taking my Lash Paradise Voluminous Mascara and I'm doing my bottom lashes. I also went ahead and I used this for my top lashes, but I didn't film it so yeah and this is the final look i hope you guys like it if you guys want to see more videos like this make sure to follow my page uh here's a close-up of what it looks like came out super cute super nice um i'm actually really obsessed with it thank you guys so much for watching love you all